Welcome back to another episode guys. I just picked Amberly up from the airport. She's back. She's been overseas for, for a few weeks. So what's been happening the last couple of days has been the shittest weather ever. Like a cyclone has passed, it didn't hit us, but it's just made the water so dirty. It's been raining, cloudy, windy. So what I'm gonna do is gonna make a little campfire and tell you guys a story. What are you bloody doing? What are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing, Eddie? Couple of rocks, I need to make a bit of a windbreak. Oh. Set high over me. <laughs> Can you build me up a little fireplace there? Just make a wall on this side, protect us from the wind. <laughs> okay, I'll do it. All right, so I made my little rock place, and so now I gotta go collect some wood and make this little fire. So you want to get some dead grass and some sticks ready, some smaller sticks and some bigger sticks. But when you light this, you don't want to light it up where you were going to do it. You want to go on the side upwind. So in this case, the wind's blowing that way. Come. You have to encourage it, babe. You have to say, go, get the big sticks. Get the big sticks. What do I do? Chuck them on there. Put them on there. And there. Go. And then you have to say, we're a fire baby. Go. <laughs> we have fire, baby! Yes! Alright, I'm gonna get straight into this campfire story. It's a little bit windy, so hopefully the audio is good. On the 16th of September 2017, me, Jared, and Tommy hooked the boat on straight after work. The weather was good and went straight out to the island to see if we can get a quick afternoon spear in. It ended up being one of the funnest dives I've been on. The sharks were thick as I better bloop that out. So when we got there, I was first in the water and I did a drop straight down. Normally it takes a little while to, for fish to come in and whatever, but I hit the bottom and a huge jobby comes straight in up over the deep ledge at me. So I was on the bottom, just scratching lightly at the reef. This thing was probably the biggest jobby that I would have shot to date. The spear went all the way through and jobbies fight so, so dirty. So it went straight into the reef and as I was coming up, I got nudged in the back and it was a shark and all of a sudden there was this like thick of sharks. Got to the top, tried to put a bit of pressure on it but it was already over. I lost my spear and everything. <laughs> What's the jobby? Is that eating? Yeah. Do that. Oh, let's go eat, bub. Shark shark as well. That was the one, boys. Woo! Jared took a drop on that to get the spear, and what had happened? Obviously, the sharks had just grabbed the jobby, done tumbles or whatever, and 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 ripped it apart. He come back up, said that the jobbies were still around.
reef back up, went back down there, shot another jobby. Same thing happened, it got sharked unfortunately. <laughs> Then we all decided that it's probably time that we have one more drop and pull the pin because the sharks were just too chaotic at this time. The sun was setting. So what happened is I took another drop, but I dropped straight on a big mac. And as soon as that mac took off, you can't see in the footage, but in the background, the sharks were just going crazy around us. So we, we actually got like pushed to the boat. We hopped in the boat and we had nothing else to do but actually fight the mackie from inside the boat. I'd never done it before. <laughs> Me, Jared and Tommy were fighting the Mackie inside the boat and the shark actually did us a favour and bit the tail off off the Mackie and we were able to get it to the side of the boat and get it in the boat. Normally I encourage um, like killing the fish straight away in the water before getting it on the deck of the boat. So we successfully landed that Mackie, it was so much fun. Anyway, we decided to pull the pin and head back in, fill it with the Mackie and cook a bit up for dinner. for another episode the weather's sort of clearing up now so hopefully the next few days we'll be able to get back out there but it's going to be so so dirty if you like it give it a thumbs up if you want to see more subscribe and uh me and Amberly we're just going to chill out here for a little bit before we watch the sun go down oh yeah 
It's Jared's birthday today, so if you want to get in the comment section and wish him a happy birthday, that'll be sweet. All right, guys. See you soon. Yo. Look at this big prickle. Ah! Damn it. Ah. All right, in you get Shredder. Up. Good girl. In you get Amberly. In you get Spooky. <laughs> <laughs>